So tomorrow, this little girly is going swimming for the first time. Look at this little girl, she's all ready for her swim class. Yay! It's nice and warm in here. Here's a quick look at the pool before we get in. And that's hopefully as gorgeous as she's going to look. Sleep in her class. Yeah. Little sleeping baby, sleeping beauty. Right, it's Tuesday. I have a polar bear here, a bag. I'm ready to somehow manage to go to a swim class all on my own with my polar bear. <laughs> Ooh, that was exhausting. That is fair to say. I don't know how single mums do it, single parents do it. It's so hard to do anything with baby on your own. I mean, going swimming is definitely setting myself a challenge, but, ah, oh, so the swim was good. The class was good. The singing was good. I was uh, pretending like I knew the lyrics <laughs> um, to all the nursery rhymes, but Mia was amazing. Oh, we are so lucky. She is such a good baby. She kind of fell asleep a little bit at the end and I fed her and woke her up a little bit but it was pretty much the end of the class, so it was fine. Um, and then came trying to shower, shower her, get her dressed, and then shower me, get me dressed, and uh, figure out how we leave with all of the stuff. <laughs> so it was quite a challenge. You would think that she'd be exhausted, but on Saturday, she was definitely not, so I think she might be the same today. Saturday, and we're going swimming! Yay! <laughs> oh, two degrees. I turned down the uh, cool hipster Icelandic rap music, which Ingmar Claims has never heard before, but it's constantly on the radio all the time. So we're heading off to swimming, and I thought I would share a little, uh, we don't know what we're doing, parent story. <laughs> I'm sure there will be numerous stories like this, but last week was the first time we went swimming with Mia, and I thought I was all organized because I'd packed the bag, had her own towel, her baby towel, I had nappies, wipes, change bag, all the stuff, swimming costume and everything, swim nappy ready. I was, um, in my mind I had the nappy that Aiden, my sister's kid, had used when he was over, so I was like, should we use it? Fine, because you can reuse swim nappies, put it in the bag, put it on her, got in the pool, had our lovely first moment in the pool with our baby, and of course it wasn't the swim nappy, so it just increased in size and got ginormous <laughs> for a child. So we're going to get out, get a swim nappy from the swim teacher. Yeah, we were those parents trying to take the nappy off of her because it was huge under her tiny little wetsuit. So if Mia is watching this in the future, I'm really sorry, but we will do numerous things like this to you and embarrass the hell out of you. But if you get to watch this, Mia, also remember that you're lucky alive to watch it, so we did a good job. So. <laughs> Yay! Go Mia! Yay! 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 <laughs> <laughs> 
I'm all dressed and ready. And this one's just chilling. Catching up, getting the gossip in the pool. Don't fall asleep, baby. <laughs> huh? No, she's okay. She's just very relaxed. <laughs> Ha, 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 ha.